What's up guys, Phoenix here. Welcome to Madden 20. I don't have 22 or 23. I don't got the money for that right now, but I hopefully will be getting it so I can play some games with Reaper, but we're going to do an exhibition. Uh, I'm going to tell you right now, we're just going to predict the Super Bowl. So we need... Oh, we need the Eagles. Did I just pass them? Oh, I didn't. Okay. Let's find these eagles. And... Gotta get the chiefs. Now... See, this is what I think. I think they predict the Super Bowl two years in advance. And that's what's going on here. Um... I don't know... I want to play, so I think, I don't think the Eagles are going to win the Super Bowl, but sometimes you got to go with the underdog, I'm just saying. Okay, uh, quarter length, six minutes, sorry, clock change, two, stuff. We're going to say nice uh, night time, it's always night time, so make it night time. It's overcast. Bam. I don't know if this is going to be right or if I'm going to predict it. Hopefully this is out before the Super Bowl. Uh, my process of downloading things so I can edit them is very tedious and takes a while. So hopefully. I mean, this is a week prior, so I would hope it would download before then. Hey, everybody. It's the coach, and this is Monday Night Football on Yes, EA. it is. Anyway. It is perhaps the best home field advantage all right, in all of go. football and certainly the loudest as we welcome you inside Arrowhead Stadium in Kansas City. Tonight we've got the crew set for what should be a real treat, a great Monday night matchup between the Philadelphia Eagles and the Kansas City Chiefs. This will be field of the deal. And a nice return right. sets him up pretty good here at the 30-yard line. So here are the Chiefs now coming out for their opening drive. Oh, look out. As we get a peek at the former Red Raider and 10th pick in the 2017 draft, Patrick Mahomes. I don't like him. Not like, I mean, like, he's a good player. I just, I don't know. I don't so like first and 10 now from the 30. The just the vibes, bad vibes. First carry for Carlos Hyde. A big hitter. That one goes for 40 yards. I know that play went to the left right. side, and that's what it was designed to do, an outside hand up there. But how about the whole offensive line being involved? Seal the left side where the play was going, where they call play side. But how about on the back side? Just taking care of business to make sure no one can get there and disrupt it. Is the biggest key the left tackle? Without a doubt. Control that edge. Get out there. You want that left tackle. If you bring your tight end over there, either way, control the edge of the line of scrimmage. You got a chance to run. Mahomes firing complete. That catch right. good for five. It's third down. Well, they're unable to convert that into much, but it's never a bad idea to try to get the ball into a tight end of his caliber's hands and see what kind of disruption he can cause. Mahomes looks to throw on third down. And it's complete to Kelsey. And down right. inside the 15, shy of the 10. An 11-yard pickup, and it's enough for a Chiefs first down. A lot of tight ends just use their size and their strength, try to occupy some space and kind of body people do away a, uh, and catch the football. But not this guy. He's a refined franchise. route runner. Oh, Makes me wonder if he took dude, some dance like classes in his background with his footwork. That's my plan. Our game not even two minutes old, but a quick red zone opportunity. They've got a first and ten at the 11. They'll hand it off now. Williams. Oh, and he takes it into the end zone for a Chiefs touchdown. Oh, Damian Williams. 
Mahomes taking it in from 11 yards out. And the Chiefs are going to take a first quarter lead. And they do exactly what they wanted to. Opening drive, they get into the end zone, they do it on the ground. And not only is the person lugging the ball happy, of course, because he got it into the end zone. How about the offensive All linemen right. and receivers who are blocking for him? They have to feel great about themselves sticking it in the end zone on a running play. All right. Oh, with your middle. Now after the touchdown, here's Butker on to kick it away. This is taken at the three. Solid return, pretty good right. field position. They'll start at the 32-yard line. So now right. here comes the Eagles offense as they get ready to take over. Now here's what they're not They'll gonna be expect. led out by they're their 6'5 quarterback out of North Dakota State. Six it's Carson five. Wentz. He didn't have as many throws or plays in college as many of the quarterbacks that were coming out in the draft but he maximized what, what he what? had. I ended up winning two national yeah, championships as a starting quarterback at North Dakota State. Now wins. Oh, he's going to air it out right away. That's going to be knocked away and incomplete. He was trying to get it to Zach Ertz that time, but it'll be second down. Well, that certainly looked like something that they discussed all week in practice getting ready for this one. Take the big shot right out of the gate oh, at worst. You'll open up the defense a little bit, loosen them up, have them back on their heels. Never mind. Never mind. Another throw on second suck. down, and this one incomplete as well. Charles already trailing by touchdown early. This offense, how imperative is it for them to get points out of this drive? Well, they feel like they have to. And he can't get rid of it. He's taken down. Even protect them. Off the edge, the sack by Reggie Ragland. We've watched this a long time. No, and what I are still you don't doing? You get it. Third and long. Why are you calling play action? Yeah, because they're not going to fight defensively, right? No, not at all. I did have a coach explain to me years ago that for some teams, that's how they have to deal with pass protection and their line blocking. But to me, it seems silly. Yeah, well, they're silly, and that leads to a play action sack. Let's go. Give them 11 yards that time on the return. And the Chiefs will have excellent right. field position here as they yeah, take they will, over. Because for some reason, I punt Here's the Kansas the City oh. offense now as they get set to take over. Over. Now they'll be looking to duplicate the efforts of drive number one that resulted in seven points in the seven zip lead. Well, you know how Eagle pressure too much this time. Like that Down he goes. That's how we do it. That's yeah. how we do it. Oh yeah, it my is. goodness, was that a defensive back that got to him with the pressure? <laughs> well, look at the former defensive back. You're, you're all smiles up here. I hope everybody can hear my smile on that play. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's get that under smoke. Protection is certainly going to need to be a bit better here on second oh, and 16. Him, bring, him, bring him, let's go. They'll run out of the gun here, Williams. Fighting room inside the 40. And finally right. down at the 36-yard line. 19 yards to pick up there. Move the chains. His first carry of their second drive, pretty solid. And, of course, remember back to their first drive, Really strong throughout that one. Not only is he getting good blocking up front, but how about his vision right. to find the holes? And he's seeing things before they even open and hurtling through them. Here we go, D. Back to the ground. This time it's high. And he'll have a gain of three to the 33. They tried a quick hitter inside, but that one was swallowed up because what they're hoping, those big defensive linemen will take the bait and move laterally and open up a crease that they can run through. Didn't happen on that play. And down he goes, taking it inside the 10, just shy of the 5 at the 6. But when you hit him on the move like that, he's able to get into open field with a full head of steam. Oh, boy, it's going to be tough to get him down. Yeah, there was a big window. They're lucky they did get him down. I think I just caused a flag, right? Okay. Now flags will come in. I took a I step forward. I think this forward, one's going to be on the defense like, for jumping. Jumping all the way from the outside, oh maybe my, getting a little early start in the right? corner blitz. And the only time it makes anyway. sense to get that penalty is exactly as you described. Otherwise, he should never get that penalty. So it's still first and goal, but now they get to try from a bit closer. You better break. Right now, you better break. 
I don't think you opened it up for me a little more. Boom, let's go. They'll run for it to tie. All right. And he's going to take it into the end zone for a Chiefs touchdown. Carlos Hyde. It's a three-yard touchdown run. And the Chiefs are able to grow their lead. And there you go. Nothing really too complex. Block, keep your assignments. Let them run it in. They did it. Fundamental what? Football. What? The blocking beats good I tackles on that one. Ball. And result, kicker. touchdown. Defense. No Nothing the kicker. The extra point. He's a football player. And the player. lead now He's stands really at 13. Tackle. So they will accept the penalty and move forward. Oh, they're going to get... Okay. Now after the touchdown, okay, give me here's Butker on to kick it away. Thought I had the uh, thought I had the music. What? And the this will be a touchback as that sails <laughs> over the end line. I thought I had the music turned off, but I guess it's not. Sent to take the field. Very nice. Let me see. Let me go to ooh, settings. Um, volume. I guess stadium speakers. We're gonna at least turn our way down. Would you go a little faster than that? Turn it down to there, because that way we can still hear it a little bit. Already down two touchdowns here in the first half. This becomes We're a pretty important him, drive, doesn't it? Try it certainly does. Right? And a lot of teams work, script plays. We know that. Actually, right? you know they, what? They have a script to start the ball game. And typically those scripts go between 12 and 24, 25 plays. Down two touchdowns early. Probably not very deep into their script. All right, look at that. Stay that with it. I don't think they'll abandon it just yet and try and generate some You're offense on this drive. Anything. At least three points get that zero off the board. That one goes one for 24 yards. I don't think it's going to work this time. Now, this will probably be the Maybe last play of the quarter. Go. Okay, what can't Deshaun Jackson we'll do? Him All right, we win. know about the catches. We just saw another one there. Also gets involved in the return game. Right. And he can break big plays like that. We've seen him do it throughout his NFL career. What do you have? What are you, you okay. thinking of anything in particular? Yeah, I'm, I'm still remembering a certain Giants <laughs> punter <laughs> not following orders. And Deshaun Jackson right. made that oh. big time right. return. You're all in, the way buddy. back for a game winner in that one. I still remember seeing the looks of disbelief on the Giants sideline. Uh, now here's a pass on first down that's knocked away and incomplete. Didn't mean to hit it again. It's I always a battle. Who's going to win on first down? The offense or the defense? Let's face it. If you've got the ball, four yards or more on first down is what you're aiming for. They tried to throw for it there. Nice effort to knock that one away and bring up second down. What's that? And he's got this down to the 35. Wentz can win. pull it down Let's when he needs to, go. and the 6'5 quarterback picks up the first down. So the youngster able to use the legs to pick up the first. And one of my pet peeves when they see this guy play, when Carson Wentz takes off running the football, I always hear people go, oh, he's sneaky out there. I'm doing it again. I'm no, just going to keep he's doing He's athletic. Watch him do it. It's an integral part of the quarterback run game, and he gets it done very, very well. Yeah, you don't like sneaky it athletic. Works pretty good. That's no, just no. kind of a jab in the back. Yeah, not when it doesn't apply. I think that's a stereotype that uh, needs to be broken down for him. Though. 16 yards, a little deja vu from the previous play where they got 16. The Eagles into the red zone for the first time. First and 10 at the ninth. And he can't find the receiver. And Nobody he's brought blocked down. him. Flying like, in to blow that play up, Alex Okafor. Well, someone's been up to the task so far in this game. They are already up a couple of scores, Brandon, and guess what? I think they're just going to pin their ears back now and get up field and get after the quarterback. Been such an impressive first half to get that lead. Dancing to his left. Shifts by at the 15. Pretty nice gain right, on the fine. scramble. Gets him 12 yards. Way, I thought they were going to sack him there like they did on first down. Great yeah, coverage, yeah. but he found a way to move with his leg. He had his ability to take off. Not only did he get some yardage back, he got a little bit extra. Why does he not throw it? Him down. So when they come up and start hitting you, like the one guy tries to tackle you, he will not throw it. If you hit X, he just does that. He actually got to give him points for the attempt, but there's just a wave of pressure there. A host of people in the area evades a few, but couldn't evade all of them. Oh, well, they flip it to the kicker. He looks like he's going to throw it. Throw it. He's not. He's not going to throw it. He's just going to pretend to. I hit circle. Get it. They try to move the chains with a surprise, but Watch. it's a turnover on Watch. down. I hit circle, and he just does that. Uh, 
know what that's about. It's very annoying. Oftentimes with these gadget plays, these fakes, we focus on the offense. We're never going to get any practice this this week. Man. But the defenses practice these situations too. And just look at it this way: the two owners sitting up in their boxes. One is saying, "Boy, is my team well prepared," and the other one's like, "I got to talk to my coaches. What were they thinking?" A short gain of just over the, two yards as the first keep half clock dips games, inside of three minutes. But the characters still look like they did from in the, the gun. Uh, it's a run for Williams. Williams. They try to quick hit her yeah. inside, but that one was swallowed up because what they're hoping this big defensive lineman will take the bait and move laterally and open up a crease that they can run through. Didn't happen on that play. Uh, now Mahomes on the bootleg. And he's got a first down and then some at midfield. Ooh. And finally taken down at the 44-yard line. 18 yards on his first catch of the game. It's a first down. Two minutes to play. First half, it's 14 to nothing. We remind you that coming up in two minutes time, we'll hand you off to Orlando or Jonathan Coachman with we'll highlights and analysis of this first half of action. Now left side on the swing pass. They hold him to only two there on the screen. It's second down. So many things have to come together just right for a screen pass to break for big yardage. The blocking, the timing of the pass to the runner, everything has to fit together just right. But on that play, the defense is able to disrupt things and hold it to a short game. A gain of 13, it's a first down. As a passer, we're always trying to find that open window to throw the ball downfield. How about this one? Right in the middle of the field, right in the heart of the defense. And taking it to the 15-yard line before he's brought yeah. down. The Chiefs will um, use the first of their timeouts as they'll stop it with just over a minute to go before halftime. Mahomes will bring him up first and 10. And he's four for four now, throwing the ball to start the drive. Now Mahomes to the right side. It's Kelsey. There you go. Now another and they're going to use all the time by the offense the time out. as the stoppage will come with a little under a minute to go in this first half. Four yards on that last completion, so that sets up second and six. Again, they'll throw with Mahomes. And they're going to get him. They bring him down to the sack back at the 16-yard line. Well, maybe that can give him a little bit of a pick me up, a little bit of a jolt. One of the few things anyway. he's going right defensively. Because other than that, it's really been a first half to forget. Yeah, got him. After the sack, things get a little tougher here. Third and long for Mahomes and the Chiefs. Throwing his Mahomes on third. And this is going to be incomplete. He got scared. He saw me coming again. He's like, no, throw it. I think all that's right. a good job there defensively. They did allow him to drive all the way downfield, but once they got their backs to the goal line, hey, whoa, they really hey, the pressure. Yo. Yeah, they let him get all the way down here. Now the field shrinks. They've struggled to convert, and that last incompletion brings up fourth. Buckers' kick here Ooh. is good. What's and the lead point? will grow. Um, it's now 17 he tackle the kicker. Still a little bit of time left like, here in the second quarter, but they the do point? get three before the half and expand that lead. And they have to be so happy about that. Have we have haven't met a team yet that doesn't put an emphasis on trying to get points on the board mm -hmm. in the last two minutes of a half. They'll be real excited to have those up on the board. Give me that. This is taken at his four. And now running right through it. Still staying on his feet? Are you hey. serious? I know the special teams coach will not permit himself a smile here, but inside he's glowing. This is what he practices for. This is what he schemes. This is what he watches tape. Look at them. They're all to like, put Dang. himself and his team in a position to score points, an absolute dream return. All right. See, that's what we do. That's what we do. Let's get this shotgun. So they'll come up first and 10 now from the 33. Working from the gun, Lance. Ertz over the middle. And inside the 20 before he's brought right. down. A big pickup there for the Eagles first down Ertz on 18 big yards. Big so we reach halftime. There you have it. Halftime quickly over. Third quarter, here we go.
Both teams appear ready for the fight ahead, and we resume action here in quarter number three. Fielded about a yard I deep. I can keep her going. I can keep her going. Can... No, maybe not. Maybe I can. And all that work, but he stopped where he ultimately would have that's been, and he's simply taken a knee, and that's the 25-yard line. It's time for our player's spotlight right now. Lose any shotgun. Out come the Eagles now as he'll go on offense first here in the third quarter. Wentz going to throw. They're down 17-0, really needing to find that offensive spark on this drive as they have it with a first and 10. The improv on the scramble need... there gets him six we're gonna, and then we're going to go down. This next one. So and that was not a bad scramble there on first down. He didn't force scramble? it, nor did he throw it away. He was able to take off, and now he's making it a very manageable second and short. And they get him down, but not before he takes it across the 40-yard line. 11 yards there, first down. Oh, yeah. Well, to me, this leads to the question, do you admire the way he puts his body out there, there all the time, or do you think he should protect himself a little bit more? <laughs> well, he's been on the ground several times with all those sacks that he's taken. So, I don't know, I kind of admire him not sacks. sliding down there, don't you? I'm with you on that one. The meter definitely leans towards admiration. Now, here's a throw right side taken in by his tight end. I get a couple. The completion good for three, and it's second down. He was out there waving Ooh, his arms. When you got a quarterback out of the pocket looking for any help, I guess waving the arms is helpful. Circle, it certainly is because you got to get his attention line. because 82, 82. now you're in scramble <laughs> drill. So everyone's what? adjusting their routes, finding open space. And that's caught inside the 30. A gain there of 30 big ones. Obviously, they're not where they want to be right now on the scoreboard. Big plays like that, though, that'll trend them in the right direction. Yeah, if you want to get that, they'll be right we're back in the it. game. We're gonna and if get they can it. continue to get it, we're going to get it. Maybe they'll inspire their defense as well to get okay. a few stops. Well, He'll get just a yard on the scramble. It's second down. Out. Looked at me like they adopted what my kindergarten teacher always said. If at first you don't succeed, try, try again. And finally, able to hold him in check. He'd been carving a the back. That's the first time That's I think okay. I've seen where the Jeez, coverage was good pile. downfield and they accounted for him and stopped him for a short pickup. Yeah, I don't think it was a big adjustment, but much more emphasis on making sure they knew where he was when he decided to take off and go. Still in search of their first touchdown of the game, but they're on the move. First and ten. That's complete. Well, they ended up the same guy. So. And able to break one I'm tackle, but then quickly I? brought yeah. down. But a nice little game. That will go as a pickup of seven on the seventh play of the drive. All right. I think the best offenses love to give the ball to their running backs in open space because they have the ability to make people miss, and they also have the ability to run over people. And if you do that throughout the game, after a while, they might just run through some of those tackles and go a long way. Well, we saw him shed a nice tackle on that one. Looking to throw again on second down. Went. And nice. he'll score. Touchdown, Eagles. Yeah. Carson wins. A three you guys wait till you meet Chucky. And the I'm Eagles making Chucky. Some He's going to be our on um, that deficit. quarterback. That's the score quarterback. you felt they had to have here in the third quarter to get back in this game. And you know that there was an emphasis on their side. Hey, we know this. We know oh, it's a fake. They'll try and throw for it. How, 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 how? Okay, just keep running. Do not Ray stop. He goes right side. <laughs> and he will get Two into points. the end zone nice. to cut the lead a little bit further. I'm surprised I didn't just get tackled. Look at how many guys are just kept trying to tackle me. <laughs> he rolled right over on his head. That was great. Watch him, watch him, watch him. He tripped. This one guy trips over. Ah, it doesn't show it. Okay. That was funny. He tripped over the other guy, and he kind of just tipped onto his head like he was a top. Now after the touchdown, here's Elliott on to kick it away. And he's going to take a knee. This is taken about yep. seven yards deep. And no run back here. This will be a touchback, and it comes out to the 25-yard line. So here's the Chiefs offense ready for their first reps in half number two. The third quarter has not been kind to them. After they built that lead at intermission, they've seen that lead shrink. And how much of that is simply execution? How much of that is maybe you lose your edge a little bit because you've got right. a lead? That's pretty good. And you do have to credit the other team some because they've made some adjustments to start to slow them down. 
Can they find those counters now? Those extra plays or plays they haven't run that'll be effective and get them back moving again. They'll be looking for something here. He ran to sees that momentum back. And across the midfield, stripe into Eagle territory. Call it a gain of four on first, and that'll make it second down. Third quarter, and you've got the lead. You're not ready to go into that four-minute offense to close the game out. But a running game can really benefit your team right now. They'll get only a couple down to the 44. Right there. Whenever we talk about the best strong safeties, one word constantly comes up, and that's instincts. Being able to diagnose runner pass and make the appropriate moves. He crashed out hard there. He was ready for that running. Can't wait for the Super Bowl, man. And he's going to have the up. first down at about the 38. A nice first down pickup on a gain of six. And that one was a lot of fun right there because that was the game within the game. Third and short, blitz was on. What's the key for the quarterback? Get out of your hands in a hurry. And that was a quick little completion. Got the job done for a first down. I think they're just going to waste the clock. On first and ten, here's Mahomes. Complete the tight end, Kelsey. I don't think so. And he's out of bounds, but not before a big pickup that time on what's going to wind up being the final play of the third quarter. We're back now in KC. It's the Chiefs with the lead and the football here as we get set for quarter number four. Oops. They'll try and run. This is Williams. If they score, they're not going to. Yeah, he takes it out. into the end zone across the chalk. They don't there care. They don't care. They're down. Gonna, they're not, they're not but I think that's run. offsides on the defense. Yeah, I think that's going to stand, partner. And yeah, that one was relatively easy to see. I noticed that from up here. Yeah, it doesn't take a whole lot, does it? Sometimes you get multiples. What I yeah. always love on these offsides is when each side, side points at the goal. other. Hey, you did it. No, you did it. They deciphered that one correctly. Now Mahomes to the line as the Chiefs are going to go for the two-point drive. Mahomes Brady. They're just going to overplay him. They'll look to run for it with Williams. And he'll get blown up behind the line of scrimmage. Back at the six. A lot of people well, don't like this. This new two-point rule came into play. They can use Offense that. There's been a lot more time working on it. That means the defense is going to do the exact same thing. If he loses, if you don't like him, you're going to watch it just to see if he wins. If you do, it's... <laughs> Now after the touchdown, watching. here's Butker on to kick it away. Whee! Oh yeah, give me that. Give me that. This We're is taking it to three. We're going to that 40. We're going to that 40. And a nice return sets him up pretty good right. here at the 30-yard line. 30 is good too. It's only 10 off. Do a quick pass. Here's the Philadelphia offensive oh, unit now as they head we're gonna to do is over we're gonna possession. Go. And for them, a touchdown their last go around. Obviously, they'll be hoping to do that again. And when you start plotting for this drive, when you start thinking to yourself, ah, what are we going to do? You don't go away from gonna, what you did before because that worked. He taught himself but you have to be prepared awesome. for wrinkles and counters because you know they'll make some adjustments. Fresh out of the locker room, they hit him with a gain of over 20. That's just his second catch of the game. They wanted to keep him silent. They have kept him silent. Defensive football 101. Jeez. Don't let the best Jeez. player on offense beat you. That Take him bullying. out of the game. They've done a great job of doing that. Ten yards on the pickup there, and it'll be second down. Two, 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 two. It is hard in zone coverage to stop a curl route because when they see it, they just try and find the open spot and sit down. Yeah, we always talk about finding the soft spot in the zone. What's the key to doing that? How do you do it? On, you have to read what the coverage is. Is it too deep? Is it three deep? Because then you know where the linebackers are going to drop, what spots in the field they naturally get to, and you find that open space, and then you're in sync with your quarterback. He should be reading the exact same thing, and it put the ball right on you. To throw the twins. Oh, he's got a man wide. Open, complete. Oh, yeah. And he'll take it into the end zone for an Eagles touchdown. Nelson Aguilar from 17 yards out. And the Eagles get a score closer. And when a Hail Mary is completed for a touchdown pass like that, I think any defensive coordinator just puts it their face matter. right into their hands. It, I don't think there's any doubt about it. And I don't so. have stats in front of me. I don't have the empirical numbers that say that in recent years, the Hail Mary pass has been completed more than it has been. But it feels that way, doesn't it? He's and I know the defenses it. are spending more time on it. I think the biggest mistake they make so they play everything from behind the receiver. Dude, I think they've got to start getting Shaq. people in front like as well to try and knock like... the ball away. Dang. Now after the touchdown, here's Elliott on to kick it away. 
Oh, he's going to take a knee. Got to feel it in the end zone. And no run back here. This will be a touchback, and it comes out to the 25-yard line. Out now the Chiefs offensive unit ready to do battle again. They're holding on right now right. to that slim advantage in a one-score game. And you hear a lot about two-minute offense and four-minute offense. Obviously, the four-minute offense applies here. How do they run that effectively? Well, you know what the four-minute offense is, is just trying to grind the clock. So you want consistent gains, steady gains. Doesn't have to be big plays, but it has to be plays that gets first downs and keeps the ball away from your opponent. But certainly throwing the ball is in the mix here. It certainly is. Just make sure that you're careful with it. And again, I just keep on taking out my <laughs> keep possession of the football. And not much to speak of. Call it a one-yard right. gain up to the 26. The second down play, not much better than the first. Just a gain of one there. From the gun on third down, the homes. And this is well, nobody said it could be him. And they work this well up Yikes. field across the 45. I mean, big hook up there. Forced to throw it on third point. down. The connection's going to keep the drive alive and also keep the clock moving. Yeah, and from a defensive perspective, didn't get a sack, didn't knock the ball free, didn't break up the pass. The clock keeps running on you. You're in a dire situation now. Got him. Got him throw home. complete to his tight end, Kelsey. And he's got this down to the 35. Okay. 17 more yards on that one as they keep the drive rolling. These guys are running offense like you drive. The pedal is down. Stomp down. How about that? Back-to-back -back completions. They are rolling. So much for being conservative and running that football. And not totally home free yet, but it's looking good as they come up first and 10. Give me that run. Give me that run. Looking right side, and that's complete to Watkins. I missed. No gain there on the completion. Second and 10. All right. And that's when it's fun to play defense. When you're able to diagnose a play right from the beginning, get all Keep your guys to the football more. and spill the play, that's when you have a lot of fun playing on that side of the ball. <laughs> I'm over here now. This is my team. This is my team. Now contact up front as penalty markers come in. Who is this against? All right, hold up. Give me a minute. So he jumped as a safety. It's all part of a you plan. might know a thing or two about that from your playing days. Well, I remember creeping up the line of scrimmage on certain blitzes or certain coverages. Never jumped off sides, though. Not once? Yellow. Not once. I wish I had a few times. It would have stopped some of those plays I got toasted up on. <laughs> After the encroachment penalty, here's second and five. Oh, they're eating the clock. How do I make how do I call a timeout? The Eagles gonna take the first of their timeouts as it comes with a minute four left to go in the game. Yellow! Like 54. You ain't got nothing. You ain't got nothing. Where's that? Where's that? And this is caught by Watkins. And tackled down after a gain of three. Lead with one yard to go on third down. Now the Eagles will use the second of their timeouts as they get it with under a minute to go now in the football game. The Chiefs on third down. They've been near perfect, four for five at this point. Here it's third and two. And he won't be close to a first down as he runs it. Into a wall right around the line of scrimmage. The Eagles will take their third and final timeout. Here as they get the stoppage with a little over 50 seconds left to go in the game. And the kick by Butker okay. is good. So and even if we get the lead up to 11. So barring something extraordinary here in the closing stages, that field goal should just about that. put this one on ice. Yeah, we've got to find two scores. So, you know, we're not going to exactly move it over there yet. It can be done, but boy, it's going to be a little bit of a stretch for him, isn't it? Yeah, they would have to move incredibly quick and have some luck, too. And he's up across the 25 do and down at the 28-yard line. So now Wentz and the Eagles down by 11. A little over 40 seconds to go. Throwing his Wentz. And got his man complete. Can't hurry up. How, oops. Play in the second half. A big Skip success over 30 yards. Well, we spent a lot of time exalting the offensive masterminds in this game, right? They draw up these beautiful plays. It looks so perfect. Up up. Yeah, man, it's caught inside the 10. 
And I think he's brought do it, down, guys. but not before he reaches the eight yard line. Back to back plays of right around 30 yards, and the field position has totally That's probably been about flipped. how it's going to be. Well, make that now two completions for him on this drive, and these aren't ordinary completions, they're big ones. Yeah, these are the types that make a secondary talk to each other and not in a good way, oftentimes yeah. pointing fingers. Hey, who's got well, it? There Someone it is, guys. It. That type of That's indecision can open up to even end. more big plays. So this one in the win column for Kansas City. And you look back what over the score sheet, interesting. A very All clean right. game, no uh, turnovers thank by you guys either side. So much for it watching. See you guys in the next one. I don't know what it's going to be, but I'm sure it's going to be just as entertaining as this. Such an emphasis Bye. on taking the ball.